I want to make this video nice and quick. The Chicago Bears are six are six eleven. Six eleven, Mac Nagy, you deserve to be fired. You deserve to let go. You deserve to be kicking the freaking butt. That's right. You deserve to be kicking the freaking butt. I wish you well. Goodbye. So long. Toodaloo. Thanks for coming. We don't want to see you no more. Goodbye. Good riddance. Because you suck. You suck as a coach and, uh, of a play calling. And you suck at well. You never execute jack on offense, defense. That's why you suck. That's pretty much all the players have pretty much given up playing. So goodbye, Matt Nagy. After that one year, you give us hope. But the rest of the years, we suck bad. It's kind of feel like we are the Detroit Lions. They deserve better. I know they're better than that, but we just we need we better than that. We're better than that. The reason why because of you. You're nothing but a sorry garbage. You suck, Matt Nagy. Goodbye. Good riddance. Had a 14 point lead in the first half. And they scored 31 points on you with no answer, unanswered points. That's why. You were up, you, we were up 14 and nothing. We was kicking butt. But till, till then, in that second half, fire Maggie. Because this Bears team is all about, because this, all this Bears organization is all about friendship. That's what it is. They don't want to win. They don't want to upgrade the stadium. No, it's about it's about friendship. That's how embarrassing this Chicago Bears fan base and this organization is. So if y'all don't do something, uh, George McKenzie, I do not trust him. I don't. I don't know about you guys, but I don't. So goodbye, Matt Nagy. Goodbye, Ryan Pace. You had opportunities, opportunities after opportunities, of opportunities of coaches. Never lead to success. So goodbye, Ryan Pace. Goodbye, Matt Nagy.